all the cultures in the world they have a common thing that they revere human life yes. taking away your own life or somebody else's life is not considered proper but if if one is really suffering one has got a bad deal in this life then why can't just one you know start a new game end this one and restart the game is there anything wrong with that so if i have a bad deal don't i have the right to shut it up and come back again if you have a bad deal with your job you could just quit if you have a bad deal with your marriage you could just divorce if you have a bad deal with the society in which you live you can come to isha yoga center <laughs> if you have a bad deal in isha yoga center you can go up the mountain so these are not good enough reasons for you to end the process of life first of all you didn't create it so you don't talk about ending it unless your identity as a separate being or a separate person has disappeared and you and the source of creation are just the same if you come to that point then you can just throw away your body consciously then you're allowed to do it not by damaging the body not by hanging from a tree we don't mind burying you under the tree but hanging from a tree is neither good for you nor for the tree whether it's a good deal or a bad deal if you have a larger purpose everything is a stepping stone everything is a stepping stone for your ultimate well being if you have set the larger goal every situation that you get into you are getting so identified and caught up with it now it feels like it's better to end your life anyway this is lot of bull because today something is going wrong you want to end your life tomorrow morning something is going right you want to live you want to have your third baby <laughs> you want to get married once again if things are going little better tomorrow morning you will have plans everything looks bleak you think of suicide isn't it so this is just a game that you're playing in your mind it once happened a salesman decided to go into a new development housing development he thought no other salesman would have still ventured yet because it's a new development so he wanted to be the first one be the early bird so he went and knocked on the very first house that he saw there a lady came and opened the door without giving her a chance he just looked into her house took a lot of cow dung fresh cow dung from his bag and threw it all over the new carpet and he said see i have a wonder vacuum cleaner you watch it i'll clean this carpet without even leaving the slightest of odor if i don't do it I will eat every piece of this cow dung myself. I will eat it. So the lady asked, "Would you like some tomato sauce?" Because we still do not have electricity in the house. what you need is a little bit of tomato sauce tastes a little good then you suddenly want to live just eating cow dung you feel like dying 
you stood up and said sadguru if you know what you are trying such nonsense should not come out of your mouth there is no meaning to sadguru when you are wanting to end your life because it's not worthwhile sitting here that's what you're telling me is it it's not worthwhile sitting here you are not in grace you are somewhere about how your job is not working how your family is freaking you how something else is happening that's all you're thinking about just be here sit down little be worthwhile i'll make it worthwhile